Deborah Myberg, and I'm with Richard Riddeford of Palliser Estate from Martinborough, New Zealand. And, and from the beginning, you've had a pretty strong export strategy. What have been some of the issues with that? Well, New Zealand has a population of 4 million people, and at our price points, about 5% is our target market. So our destiny was always offshore, not onshore. Mm. I don't have enough money to establish a global brand, so what I've tried to do is use other global brands. It's the same with international airlines. I mean, our wines have been on, obviously, in New Zealand, but Cathay Pacific, Lufthansa, the Emirates, Qantas, and in effect with those airlines, it's the only market I know where you're segregated at the door. If you've got a lot of money, you turn left. <laughs> so, yeah, I like to have them in first class because it is a private wine tasting. It's an incredible endorsement. Yeah, yeah. For, and for three months of the year, and it's a difficult tasting to leave. Mm -hmm. Ultimately, you can't deny what's in the glass. I mean, people who know about wine will understand our little difference. And with Sauvignon Blanc, it's a classic example. Uh, we're not from Marlborough, we're from Martinborough, and yet it's recognized the Palace of Sauvignon as being consistently one of the best. Tell yeah. me a little bit about the Sauvignon Blanc we have here. This is 2008. 2008, that is uh, full of fruit, but it's nicely balanced. We leave our Sauvignon on lees for longer, mm. and I always think that our wines drink, well, Sauvignon Blancs drink better in, in the year following, 09, as opposed to the year it was produced, 08. Um, but the key, as I said earlier, is that it must taste all right in the glass because it doesn't actually matter what I say or do. If it's not in the glass, we've got a problem. Um, you mentioned that you like the, the Sauvignon Blanc to have a bit of age. What is the change that you see takes place? It just becomes more balanced and drinks better. Um, there's always a rush to get New Zealand Sauvignon Blanc into the market. In fact, I would think there's some 09s already here, but great wine needs time, like everything. Well, I'm looking forward to the time to drink the great wine. Thank you so much. Thank you.